KYTPC, this is Ray, Smoking Tucky Piper here. Hope you're all having a good day. Today I wanted to go ahead and announce my 100 sub goal. Once again, thanks to everyone uh, that subscribed to get me to 100 subscribers. I definitely appreciate you guys. So this wouldn't be possible without you. So that's why I wanted to do this. Here. I'm just having some McBaron um, Cherry Ambrosia in this uh, Dr. Graybo Omega. First thing we're going to be including in the gall is the 7LE Series 3 628 Volcano. It's actually pretty good. The I did have this one pit, but this is a brand new, unsmoked. This is a 9mm. Um, I know a lot of people um, will only smoke a, a filtered. And I wanted to make sure that this was an option for anyone. Uh, if you're not a filter smoker, I did get both the 6mm and the three millimeter adapters so you could take it down to either a six millimeter if you wanted to or all the way down to a non-filtered three millimeter but that's going to be the first thing also going to be including a tin of haunted bookshop Brand new tin. And a pouch of Missouri Meerschaum's American Patriot. This is a favorite of mine, so I'm including one of these. This one, normally when you get a pouch, it has cellophane on it, but this one didn't. I got, a, got one for myself at the same time, and I found it to be a little dry, so I went ahead and put this one in a Ziploc to try to maintain what moisture is in there. And that's how that'll come to you. Once again, that's brand new, unsmoked. Um, this is going to be open to you know, wherever you are in the U.S. or in um, uh, overseas as well. The only difference is uh, shipping uh, tobacco overseas is so complicated. Some areas you can, some you can't. If you're overseas and you win, You'll get the pipe and the adapters, um, not the tobacco. If, uh, if you're overseas and you win, I'll try to work something out with you to see about maybe PayPaling you something to be able to, you know, get a tin of, you know, either a bookshop or whatever you like where you can get it. If you're in the U.S., of course, you'll uh, be able to get all of this. In order to uh, win, you do have to be a subscriber. If you do not have your subscriptions uh, public and they're private and you don't want to set it to uh, public what you can do is take a screenshot showing that you're subscribed and send it to my email address i will have that down in the humidor but it's smokingkypiper at gmail.com you can just send that i'm going to insert a picture right here once again I'm not pointing at anything in particular, it's just that uh, it's a reminder for me when I'm editing where to put this. Okay, and that was a picture of Devlin. Devlin is uh, my cat, it goes by Debbie for short. It's one of many I've had, but it's the only one I've ever had that had a, a pipe related name. What I'm looking for for your entry is I want you to tell me have you ever had a pet that you gave a pipe related name to? If not, if you did, what would you name that pet? If you are a presenter, I want that in VR form. If you're not a presenter, you can put it in the comments 
in this video. Um, I'm not going to weight these. I, I want non-presenters to have as much chance as presenters. So it's going to be you know one entry, one chance per entry. If you are not a presenter and wanted to do a BR, of course you're welcome to do that. I would certainly, it would be a great way for the, the YTPC to get to know you a little better. But it, it's not a requirement. Um, I know sometimes you'll want to enter and say, if I win, please give it to this person. That's certainly acceptable. If you do that, keep in mind that the person that you're nominating to receive it also has to be a subscriber. So keep that in mind. But this is, as I said, it's open to anyone, not just the, the U.S. But once again... Um, if you're within the U.S., it's going to include the pipe, the adapters if you want them, and the tobacco. The only thing not included, if you're international, is going to be the tobacco, in which case I will try to arrange something with you to maybe PayPal you some funds to be able to pick up a, a tin of what, either a haunted bookshop or whatever you'd like. I will run this through the end of the month, through the end of May, so about June the 1st I will make the drawing, but the deadline to enter is May the 31st, that's the last day to enter. Again, what I'm looking for, have you ever had a pet that you've given a pipe-related name? If so, what did you name the animal? If not, if you did have an animal and wanted to give it a pipe-related name, what would you name it? That's it today. I just wanted to make this short and go ahead and get this out so you guys can uh, start getting your responses. Once again, um, Put your responses below. If you do a VR, be sure you include a comment with a link to it so I can find it easy. Um, a lot of times I'm looking at this on my uh, tablet and it can be a little difficult to track everything down using the tablet. But I hope this video finds you well. And until we see each other again, my friends, I want to say wado. That's Cherokee for thank you. Have a great day.